Next night's characters. Characters. Again, same rule as all the other tier list. S is going. You can see that one at the end, and that means A tier is not going to be affected. The same with the F tier, not to the end. And with D tier, you can. It's just the same. Okay, Clay, easy A tier. Probably the e easy one of the best character of the entire show. Like, come on, it's Cl Clay, great character. I know they don't go through that much character development, but I still think he's so sick. Like leader and stuff. Like I know it's completely different than it's from Ninjago for me. I know that. I still think Clay's great, and actually I think he goes through it because from the beginning. Through, straight through how the it was in the rules go through that to now not do that like you can do do what's right while from totally the rules i think it's how it was i don't fully remember again it's been like years since i wasn't i just think it's it's great character and especially in season three and season four because we see then in season, like he begins more and more to source a stone, and then he, oh, great, he got the stone variant, excellent, that's great, and then, okay, then he turns a stone, and blah blah blah, and then we, when he saved himself, that's so good. Lance is, he's DTM. Come on, he's so annoying. Okay, I can put him CC, but he can't be a little funny. Okay, Maisie is BTM. Maisie is good and all. Like she was the girl, and she was supposed to be a presence, but she wants to be a knight instead, to be one of the main knights and stuff, and blah blah blah. Yes, yeah, I think this is great. Like from being that confident of herself to actually be pretty confident. Aaron is also great, especially in season four because he became a leader and stuff. Yeah, I put him right next to Maisie and stuff. He's great and all, and like funny and. Season one is I'm fearless, but he fears to do nothing, and yeah, I don't know. Axel, also a fun fact with my childhood actually, with my friends actually next to us is the one we played the we, like played the most when we like we act we were the characters and stuff from season five because um, we didn't have a gallery, so we tried to create that own. So much fun! I'm not gonna lie, it was so fun. I don't blame my friends doing that. Axel, I will put him in season. Uh, I will put it a little over Lance. Actually, again, Lance actually from the rich snobby guy. You find out he was forced to be a knight, but he wanted to be an actor. And then later on, like he couldn't do a single thing by himself. But then he kind of figured out to do more by himself. And I think that's great character. Axel, he's actually literally the same throughout the entire story. And Okay, no, that has to knock him down a bit. So excellent. So fun, but getting really tired of you just eating a lot. But, and kind of stupid. Anyway, she's kind of annoying, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'll put her there. She's the smart, like the nerdy one, like, you know. Nerdy more. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, yeah, she's here. She's cool and helpful. Murloc, I I like Murloc. He's so funny. Okay, no, he has to be here. He's f so funny. Sensible, but way more goofy, like to a full normal level. Like Jesus Christ, and he forgets a lot. That's really annoying. Like the serious, like sorcerer to then when he got to two point and then he got a little buggy, and that's it's really sad. I hope uh, maybe in season five he maybe somehow got out of his form. That was what I really wanted to hope for that, but maybe someday, I don't know, okay, if Tommy and Andreas and got the rice back. Robin, I uh, will put him right here. No, uh, he's, yeah, he's, uh, he helps them a lot, and he really wants to become knight faster than he actually is, and stuff, and he helps them a lot. Like, uh, Jesus Christ, he helps them so much. Okay, just what we have to go through. And normal just roll in the beginning was clumsy, and then mo the Book of Monster, or I'm just going to say Monstrox, like he manipulated him, and he was so b a clay again, so wholesome to him, like, come on, you're not that bad. 
Like, come on, I believe in you. He believes in you. He tries to cheer you up, and that's just so cool, good. I like that. Just normal gesture is definitely going here. This gesture is funny. Uh, okay, I, okay, I can put just this gesture. It's not as like. I don't know, he's not as serious a villain, I feel like. Sometimes he can be, but um, most of the time it's just a joke. But this one, I actually kind of like him a lot more. His design is way cooler, and he has to lose a lot of, like that. He's just a new color and he, ugly teeth. Then here, he gets hooked teeth. He got electrifying instead of just. Like, he has a part of the theme. Way more than he was here. Still really cool design. But this design is just so freaking cool, man. And he, I feel like he's way more even now. And every time he became a little more soft. Got a little sprinkle of monster trucks. And boom, he snapped right back into it. He got... Then we got the queen. I forgot her name. Like, I forgot the name. Um, I put her... No, I put her here. Right i put her yeah, yeah, that's a good place. Means his mom, like, kind of good mom. Like, she believes a lot of her daughter and stuff. Really cool. And, she, yeah. I, I, I don't know. Uh, uh, the king, he's damn. I'm sorry. But he's... Oh, my love. Okay, maybe I would be do the same. But come on, he wants to be a knight. And I would still believe instead of, it took him... 10 episodes that's like so many months before he has to listen to her and promote and then in the she actually became a full knight there and stuff okay monster book first book of monster really good i actually really like his game um, um i'll put him right here oh come on do we not get his stone colossus form I guess not, but uh, he's pretty good. He's pretty evil. I know people are tired. Ty oh come on, four season with the same villains. In each job, we like if they do the same thing, that would be so boring. Let's see, Garmadon, pilots, Garmad, a little bit, a little bit in season one, season two, season eight, and season nine. Four. Let's just say. Four and a half season, he is evil. He's a villain. Okay, we can just say four season because he helps a lot in that in season one. So four season, he's the main bad guy. The same amount of these two differs. So I'm tired. But then we got monstrucks in his sky says claustrophobic easy aids here easy aids here he is so freaking cool love him love him is he's so evil easy he's so freaking evil and stone claustrophobic just terrorizing through the city and the final battle so good so incredibly good love that yeah so cool that stupid robot I no I and this this guy with that stupid hair? No. Clay's mother is right here. And also, actually, before uh, Monstrax Max for me. Um, okay, we can do that with it. She is evil B word. Jesus Christ. So cold against Clay. Spoiler alert, but she's Clay's mother. <laughs> yeah, that was a. Uh, Really insane moment. I love that. Um, and then we got a good form, like um, is it below? Let's do this. Don't know too much. I know we don't know much about it, but I can show you he that his design is so cool. I will put him here because he's so freaking cool. I like his design a lot. Like he's so freaking evil. Come on man. He's so I don't know. He's just really cool to look at. His design is awesome and stuff. And actually when I was asked uh, maybe 
We don't know. Maybe he's Clay's father. It's just a theory, a film theory. Okay, no. Okay, okay, no. But uh, yeah, I, I think he's Clay's father because it feel like when we so Rina just came like there's a thing going on. So could he be Clay's father? I kind of like I feel bad, but I also kind of hope so. I think that would be so sick. But that also in season two really messed up with the ending where he almost tried possesses his body like. Oh my god, you possess your own son's body? Are you kidding? But yeah. Um, also, in the sets where he got the, the digital form, um, where he just... I have thought maybe in the end, maybe he would go out so he's not trapped anymore and we can actually see this one in action. This guy is so freaking annoying. He's... Look, look at him. Okay, Stone Clay is another eight. Yeah, so freaking cool as Stone Clay. His evilness so good for like for a villain uh, like a hero to a villain so cool the, the, the like i when i remember watching like because before i came in denmark like it was on youtube and stuff i just watched some of the clips oh my god i was so sick oh my god i was so freaking sick love his design as stone like it's basic but it's it's a Affected. Like, oh my god, he's so freaking cool, man. And then he just boom because he was still in the Nexo Power, obviously. I think, yeah, Nexo Power. And then he can just um, slam on them. Like, he actually have the triple Nexo Power stuff to just destroy all of them. That's so freaking cool. And then in the end, when he realized this is not good, and he got so, like, it was just so cool. This guy is another TTA, he's freaking annoying. And the same would go with all these. Yeah, they are so freaking annoying. Um, Burnsy goes right here. He cannot go in BTA, but it's still freaking funny. Sparks, I kind of always like him a little more. Beastmaster, I think it was called. He goes right here. Bookholder, I feel bad for him, so he has to go here. Lavaria is definitely the best of the lava monsters. So right here, just was we know all know his secret love with her, the general something. I actually really like his character. I think he needs to, to be in them more. He was in one season, but his what we saw of him was great. Lavaria, she's uh, she's here. She's just annoying. I think. Yeah, I think he's the one I like. Oh, he's okay. He's, he has to be up here, and I like. Uh, I forgot those two names. Yeah, actually, when I talk about seasons, this is probably like he's probably the most goofy of the stone villains, in my opinion. Uh, I put him here. He's not as memorable, but he is pretty cool. I don't remember his name. The, the brothers is pretty cool and they're really dangerous. I have actually kind of like the, the smallest one. Boom. Yeah, I think that's it. Those three freaking terrifying um, things. Um, yeah, they go there. Pretty evil. Okay, he's also pretty goofy. Um, he's here. Okay, this goes over here. Then we go. He. Uh, no, some people think he is Clay's father. That just didn't even want to make sense. They, these two, didn't even interact. But he's freaking badass. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, plus, plus, Klaus is beast. Oh, he's so cool. Yeah, he's definitely there. They have way more evil the stone ones. And they got Lance Robot. Also, many of the times feel bad for him. I would put him right here. Okay, he has to go right there. And the chef robot. You could be right next to your buddy, Axel, you know? And uh, this guy, no. This guy is also pretty. Same with these. Okay, they're pretty funny. You can, I'm not gonna lie. It goes right there. Lance's uh, little sister, or was it cousin? I really don't remember. She goes right here. This guy is kind of okay. He's still a little kid. 
he's pretty cool, but the goal, all this gold, and you know, and it's like this. This guy is also pretty annoying. Axis mom's are pretty annoying. I kind of like his dad. He's kind of cool, you know. I'll put him right here. His sister's freaking weird. Last his parents is tr trash because like the tree the lands bad. I don't. And that's reason why, another reason why he became like this. This guy is also pretty annoying. Okay, no, he doesn't go AFT. Oh, does he? This guy, he's pretty funny as well. I put him right there. Oh, that guy, he was kind of fun. No, he was also kind of fun. All the. Yeah, he's. Yeah, and they go right there. Man, there's a all the characters. Now it's just who goes in FT. Who annoys me the most is basically. Oh, that's a really tough now. I have to go with her because the one we see the most. And then her partner right there, and then he's there. Yep. Uh, yeah. Boom, and then, yeah, there's, yeah, wait, he, he has to go there, there we go, and then here, clay, I said uh, clay, and then stone clay is right there, yeah, this is my Nixonite character tier list, yeah, so you have watched this video, so nothing about to say to you guys, and have a beautiful day, guys, goodbye, okay, yeah, so, yeah, clay is the freaking goat, uh, um, let's go into 